the first synchronization example uh, will be application initialization. The get all rule is run on every ta data table when the application is first initialized. Initialization occurs when the application is first, uh, first started. Step one, which is inserting and updating, and step two, uh, primary key updates on the mobile device, are benign in this case because there is no data to send to the database. We'll be looking only at steps, two, at steps three and four, which are requesting information from the database and then accepting the data from the database onto the mobile device. To illustrate this, we're going to look at an example in Dragon Red Designer. In Dragon Red Designer, we have our sync tutorial application already created. In this case, we're going to look in the tables section under uh, sync part one. We have two tables defined, real estate listings, RE underscore listings, and all list ID. In both of these tables, we have data synchronization set up with a get all rule which is defined as simply table select. The table select is simply a copy and paste of the data definition select statement. In this case for the listings we're going to select a number of columns from our database uh, with no where clause. The same thing for the all list ID it has a simple select statement which selects uh, a number of columns from the database Using our Dragon Red Designer, once we open the application for the first time, it performed a synchronization. It went to the database and pulled out all of the listing IDs as defined in the data synchronization rule, and it updated the all list ID table with the select statement that we see here. We can see the exact data that was sent for debugging purposes by looking at our Dragon Red host. Under the logs section on our host, we select the logs, we can see recent table sync data, and we can see that <coughs> there is a number, of a number of tables that were sent back to the device. So looking at the timestamp for today, we see the RE listings table, the real estate listings table, underscore out, meaning it's sent from the database to the mobile device. And we can look at the data that was sent from the database to the mobile device. This is the Dragon Red table format. We can see that there's a num in within a table there's a number of records. Each record has a number of fields. This can be useful in debugging synchronization rules. We can also see that the all list ID table was updated and this is a lookup table in this case listing all of the IDs associated with the listings. Back on our mobile device, we see that our, our grid has been updated and we have data that we can work with.